making a few moves and just has been stopped in his tracks by this gentleman who looks like he's got a decent hand here and he's thinking about something. Well, Ronnie has to feel like everything's going his way. It's 6,000 to call, but he's having a bit of a look around his left. And uh, the decision is just to limp in. Alani played a pretty solid game all so far anyway. And John Regis has been a little bit cool. weak cool. in calling perhaps too many times with no weak hands. Well, this uh, three and 6,000 level will be really telling for John Regis, won't it? Uh, He's got... Uh, Needs to hit a card. Yeah, Needs to get some chips going. He's down to about 30,000. It's only five big blinds. And uh, this 18,000 now in the pot is actually a very significant for John Regis's stack. He has not flopped the best hand. Pair of fives for both Fiona and Ronnie. Check. And Fiona Check. has the kicker to spare. Check. Bet should do it here. Ronnie has put 6,000 in. You think Fiona can work out that she's ahead? I think she's going to work out to fold. I don't know why. Yeah, that's what I know. Six plus six, says Fiona Foster. She's got the best hand now. Can Ronnie take the hand? That's excellent poker. I mean, you either fold or raise, really. You don't call, and he's done. she's done the right thing there. Superb play. Completely put me in my place. No one to play with? There's always PartyPoker.com. No one to play with? There's always PartyPoker.com. We are still five here on the PartyPoker.com European Open. So 9,000 in the pot before the players see their cards. And the stakes creeping up there. Leilani. Been raising with these hands and calling, doing both. Cool. That's just a flat call from mm -hmm. first positions. And, I mean, John Regis at the point right now where the all-in move might be his only weapon. Yes, now he's down to five times the big blind. <coughs> And the blinds will be Ray, coming round to him soon. This is the second time Pass. when Fiona Foster has raised with an ace. Six, and I was saying Leilani had a better ace, but Ronnie O'Sullivan here with the ace Call. king and now just, just calling. calling. Oh, <laughs> well, what, what would an ace do? I tell you, there's one of them left in the deck, and if it comes, it's going to be goodbye to someone, sailor. Fiona Foster, the aggressor. And look at this, it's everybody nobody. has missed. Gives Ronnie O'Sullivan check, check, check. an inside straight draw. He's in much check. the best position. Can't really know that, though, at all. And must be worried about the jack and the ten. Fiona put check. the brakes on, check. and now she's got check. a straight draw of her own. Check. Deuce would fit her nicely. Both Turn and River, both for free. They've, both, they've all slowed up, and the two hits! <laughs> she's got the straight! <laughs> Fiona hits the jackpot. But will she get paid? Or will she get any money out of check. this? Check, check, check. Well, she knows she's hit it. That's what that bet means. And how big? 10,000. 10,000. Ronnie doesn't look happy. It's put Ronnie in a very tough spot, hasn't it, Steve? I mean, you, you can almost see him trying to call him this. So there's, there's not much out there. He might reckon the ace-king's high. He's got enough chips to call with. He can cool. take a chance on it in that respect. Pass. Showdown straight, he says. <laughs> How'd you find it? <laughs> and Ronnie, stunned. Well, the celebrities could take a few tips off this man. He's one of the world's best. Just ask him, Phil Helmuth. So you want to be a great poker player? This is what you're going to have to do. You have to play very patiently at the beginning of each level when the blinds are slow. And patience is important because a lot of people that get impatient bust themselves. You're going to have to make sure that you don't make mistakes, especially obvious, silly, or stupid mistakes. You're going to have to pay attention to the players across the table from you and look at them and know whether they're weak or strong. That's what separates the men from the boys. Finally, you're going to have to be able to take advantage of the information. When you see that they're weak, you're going to have to make big bluffs. 
and when you see that they're strong, you're going to have to fold strong hands. And that is the secret of No Limit Hold'em. Pass. Pass. We raised with this before, John. Cool. Cool. Back to cooling. And now Fiona's got the sevens. Raise. Raise. <laughs> She's a bagger, isn't she? <laughs> Look at John's face. <laughs> 10,000 more, 16 total. Someone stop this woman. <laughs> um, I mean, it's a lovely raise, isn't it, Steve? Beautiful raise. <laughs> would have been interesting to know what would have happened if John had raised. <laughs> yeah, I don't yeah. like it. <laughs> if John had gone all in with his like king, it. queen, and over bet, a massive score. one. 10,000 to 12. Paul's got the exact same hand. Why are you so mean for? Why are you so mean for? Why can't you be gentle with me? I'll call him. Cool. Oh, and finally he's cracked. To some degree, anyway. He must think he's behind. Well, cool. suicidal, cool. these two lads here. Yeah, isn't it? this pot has gotten very big, and if, uh, <laughs> you have to fancy that no matter what comes, Fiona might just come out betting. If a king or queen doesn't come, uh, she can take out yeah. two of them here. This could be a, an enormous change in the seating arrangements. Two sevens in the pack, and they've been helped. I wonder which one will know. Check. <laughs> 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 I think Ronnie O'Sullivan's chair collapsed. He went from high to low. He went from highest to lowest. <laughs> One minute he was taller than Lalali, the next minute he was below her. It's kind of a dangerous situation for both uh, Robbie Paul and John Regis. I mean, they have to beware of the check. ace, don't they? Yeah. Yeah, check is free. I'll do that. Okay. Could be checked all, all the way checked. down. Uh, this is going to help. Um, the situation from Fiona's point of view, should a seven come at any stage, they'll probably check it again. Oh, oh she's going to bet. She's taking this as a sign of weakness. Not really, it may not be in her best interest. To 20, I don't think they can lay it, they can't afford to lay it down, can they? Well, they've both, I mean, this 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 20,000 bet is basically all of Robbie Paul's and John Regis's chips. They can't afford to lay it down, one of them can't afford to lay it down. They, one of them might get rid of it, but not both, I feel. Check raise, eh? Oh, he's talked himself into check raise. Steve, do you, do you fancy Ravi Paul thinks maybe he's up <laughs> against three aces? <laughs> he's talked himself into one massive hand against That's him. My spider sense <laughs> and he's talking himself <laughs> into another one. <laughs> well, you got John as well. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is a very, this is obviously Robbie Paul realizing this is the decision of the tournament for him, and he's decided. Sling it. Yeah. <laughs> Will that talk John Regis into throwing it away as well? <laughs> That's why I am out like that so I, you so. I think uh, John may not be so advanced in the poker world to, to throw this away as well. Not at all. Okay. I think it will help him to some degree. I it over to me. I never saw it. Do you want me to show the underlying? <laughs> oh no, of Robbie Paul. Oh no. They said because one of Robbie <laughs> Paul's cards were exposed, they're going to have to turn them both over. And this could be the worst thing for John Regis to see. Okay. He's going to okay, see okay. the hand that folded is one he has. Big pressure on him folding as well. Sometimes a little too much thinking is a, is, is a bad thing. Surely for this much money. But there again, we're watching here at home. We've seen what they've got. They must be talking themselves into Fiona having an ace. She's got to have an ace. She looks, she she looks, looks like she's like got an ace. She's got aces like written all over her. Look at it. You can see it on her she face. She looks like a cat that ate the canary. This would hurt. Yeah, I've talked myself into now, talking myself into, talking John into folding this now. It's all changed now that I know that she's got an ace. And possibly two of them. She's holding trips. And he's talking. Yeah, here it goes. He's looking for advice from Robbie, who's thrown away the same hand. Cool. Oh, oh, he's done it. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's been rumbled. 
she certainly has. I mean, this is great for John Regis has made a big call here, right, Steve. Right, decision, and, uh, and a good call as well.